Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I have been away for the past few months and I am really sorry about that. Basically my explanation is that I've been busy, I've moved out of home and I've moved up north so I've moved out of cities as well which is a big step for me and I am going to uni now and I'm doing a lot of adult things and to be honest it's kind of freaking me out but I love it and I'm actually just really happy that I found something that I want to do so yeah sorry about being away and I am back now hopefully with more videos so for today's video we are going to be doing um, a piercing frequently asked questions basically because a while back on Instagram I uploaded on my story saying you know should I do a piercing FAQ or should I do a Q&A because I was stuck with ideas and I was like hey I've got some free time I haven't uploaded in ages so why not make a video. If you guys do have ideas anything it can be a challenge, it can be pranks, it can be a tour like you know a house tour, room tour, uni tour, anything, um, any questions like about anything, frequently asked questions about anything really. Like, I don't really, I'm not bothered, I'm open to, you know, sharing what i got and giving out my advice. Um, so please comment back below if you do have any ideas or anything, or on my Instagram posts. My main account is Indy underscore Cabral, I'll be in the link in the description below. Anyway, let's jump right into this video. So, first question is, how many piercings do I have? I have 12 piercings. Um, I've got five on my ear on this side and three on this side. And I got my nose, my pan. My um remember all, you can't see it because it's not in the moment. But let's just keep going anyway. And I got my belly button. Um number question number two is which piercing hurt the most? I would have to say my nose piercing hurt the most. Like it was just a really horrible experience. It was at Cosmetics Plus, which is a makeup store. Um, I don't really know why I went there. I was 12. It was cheap. It was like $40, I think. And, you know, it was just really horrible. And I ended up fainting. But, like, I was just looking at the needle and everything. And I was just, like, getting grossed out. And then I started feeling really sick. And then I fainted. But, oh well. Life goes on. Um... Question number three is, any piercings I've taken out? I've taken out two piercings, well, three. I've taken out my smiley, which is up here. And I've taken out my other side of my angel bites. Because I had angel bites, but one got pulled out. And that just closed over, so, yeah. And I took out my belly button piercing because I pierced it myself once upon a time like before I got professionally pierced and it was just I'm not even gonna go there but it was a horrible thing and um yeah I don't know why I did that I do regret it so much I don't recommend piercing yourself at your own home but anyway moving on question number four is how old was I when I got my first piercing I was around seven years old because yeah, that sounds about right. My sister was like nine. I think it was her ninth birthday actually. So I would be like seven and a half years old. But she got her ears pierced and I was like, oh mum, I really want my ears pierced too. Can I copy you? Because, you know, she's my older sister. And I was like, oh yeah, I, I'm cool. If I do what she does, then I'm cool. It makes me cool. So I got my, you know, these were my first piercings. Um... Where did I get my piercings? So I got my first piercings, like my ear, my normal ear ones, um, at a pharmacy in Newtown with my sister. And then I got my second piercing would be my nose when I was 12 or 13. And I got that done at Cosmetics Plus. Then it was my belly button and I got that done um, at did I get that done? In Rotorua. Yeah, at Skin Graft in Rotorua. Um, that was fine. She just didn't give me much information about it, but that's okay. I got all my, the rest of my ear piercings all done at once at a pharmacy in Rotorua. I don't know which one it's called, but 
I was like 15. And uh, I mean, my most recent piercing, my tongue piercing, I got that done at Fish Wound. And that was my favourite piercing experience. Um, my angel bites and my smiley, I did do myself at home. And I didn't really ever have a problem with it, but I do have very fast healing like skin and a very fast healing body. So, you know, I, I don't get infected easily. It's just me, so I do not recommend doing that at home. If you are, make sure you sterilise your needles and have everything on, on deck basically. And please be safe about it. Um, what is my favourite piercing? My favourite piercing has to be my tongue piercing. Um, I just love it like, I've chipped my tooth once, that's the thing about getting tongue piercings, it's like, mmm, give or take. If you bite on your tongue piercing, it really hurts, like it fucking hurts. Um, I, yeah, I mean, you're eating food and it's in the it's like, oh my god. <laughs> but, it is my favourite piercing. And question number seven is my least painful piercing. My least painful piercing was my tongue. Again, um, apart from my ears, like it was definitely my tongue. I didn't really feel it. And like getting it actually pierced, it didn't hurt. But the swelling up hurt like a motherfucker. So apart from the swelling, like so the actual piercing moment, it didn't hurt. Um, I mean, my second, like, least painful piercing would have been my belly button. Um, this is the last but not least question. Do I have any more piercing plans? Um, to be honest, no, I don't. Like, not really. I might redo my other side so I have angel bites again if I decide to, you know. But that's just like an idea. Um, apart from that, I might get my nipples done. I mean, but that is it. I don't want lots of piercings. I don't want a bridge piercing. I don't want septum piercing. I don't want eyebrow piercing. You know, people who do that, that's great. You do you. But I think um, for me, I've got enough piercings and I just... Yeah, I feel like, you know, what I've got, I'm happy with, and that's enough for me. I might get my nipples done, but that's going to be it. That's my piercing life over after that. So, to end this video, I'd just like to say, yeah, that's all my frequently asked questions. I do get asked those questions a lot, like, in person. It's not generally over social media. It is a bit, but you know, just my friends and stuff. Um, so if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, follow my social media. I'll put my Instagram in the link below, right down there in the description. And then, yeah, if you've got any ideas, if you want me to do anything, challenge, house tour, anything, Please comment that below or comment that on my Instagram and have a good day all my lovelies wherever you are and I hope everybody is happy to see me again.